The former world number one had not tasted victory since July 2016, but the New Zealander produced what she described as the best shot of her career to clinch the LPGA Mediheal Championship in California Sunday. Since her last tour win, the two-time major winner has changed her swing, her caddy, her coach, her equipment and suffered a slide down the world rankings. In February, she slipped out of the top 10 for the first time since her brilliant professional debut in 2013. But just five days after her 21st birthday, KO's fortunes turned at Lake Merced Golf Club, the venue of back-to-back -back wins in 2014 and 2015. With both KO and Minji Lee tied at 12 under through 72 holes, the championship went to a playoff. On the first extra hole, the PAR 518th, KO responded to the pressure with a sensational three-wood approach shot to within inches of an albatross, two shots on a PAR 5. It left her with a three-foot putt for an eagle, which she sunk for a memorable win. Reed, South Korea's golfing women Reed, Woods resumes comeback Can KO use this win to rise back up the rankings? Have your say on our Facebook page. 15th LPGA win, I knew I had to hit it really good to carry the tree and to reach the green, especially with Minji being a good 20 yards in front of me and it looked like she was going to hit an iron, said Ko, who was born in Seoul, South Korea but moved to New Zealand as an infant. If the ball kicked left from where it landed, it could have gone in the bunker, which is the worst place to hit it for that pin position. I needed it to kick straight and to be nice and tight up to that pin. Everything that could have happened went the right way for me. K.O., who won silver in the 2016 Rio Olympics, went into the final round with a one-stroke lead, but she slipped back with three bogeys in the first six holes. In a final round where the lead changed four times, K.O. rallied over the last nine holes, recording three birdies and a bogey, to take the championship to a playoff. It's crazy because I was three over for the day at one point, K.O. said. I said, hey, you've just got to focus, you never know what could happen, and I was able to kind of put my game together on the back nine. When that putt dropped I was like, oh my god. A lot of emotions, my whole team and my family have worked really hard for this moment. In 2015, aged just 17, KO became the youngest world number one, but prior to Sunday she had not won a tournament in 43 events since the Marathon Classic in July 2016. Her victory at Lake Merced was her 15th career win on the tour. Visit for more news, features, and videos, I don't think I've ever cried in the other 14 wins, added Ko. It was emotional. The whole team is part of it and they put in as much work as I have. That's why it's so meaningful. It's pretty cool that my family are here and my friends are here.